Hello everyone, and welcome to my Bachelor official YouTube channel. I hope everyone is having a wonderful day. Before we begin, please hit the subscribers button and give this video a thumbs up. We're reliving a significant period in Bachelor Nation history as we watch season 9 of Bachelor in Paradise. With their very first split week twist, Bachelor in Paradise created history this week last year. The original Paradise cast dispersed, and the women fled the beach during this week. For a week, the men and women were divided up and given the opportunity to get to know five new newcomers each, while also testing their initial relationships. Feelings were running high, and you simply thought B.I.P. couldn't get much more dramatic. Think again. According to Jess Palmer, everything is going to change. Paradise as you know it now won't exist again. An absolutely atomic-level bomb that was dropped of biblical proportions that will be written in the Paradise Hex was how Aaron Clancy put the moment. The initial couples were allowed to go on separate dates during split week and were not allowed to communicate with each other at all. The five women that became part of the initial male cast of Paradise were Florence Alexandra, Kate Gallivan, Elisa ICK, Jacinia Cruz, and Sarah Hamrick. The breakup infuriated the original ladies, with Genevieve labeling it asterisk kicking insane, and Lace calling it Soap asterisk kicked up. They had no idea that five more men would be joining them at their new hotel when they sobbed as they packed their bags. At their new hotel, Adam Todd, Rick Leach, Tyler Norris, Olu Onajide, Alex Bordyakov, and the other men joined the original group of women. More from the notorious split week may be seen below. Jerry Turner, the Golden Bachelor, may have revealed the season finale. Lots of admirers believe he did. Many think he may have given away a little too much information when he appeared on a chat show last week. How come they believe this? Did Jerry Turner, the Golden Bachelor, ruin his big reveal? Following his appearance on Jimmy Kimmel Live, several fans started to wonder if Jerry Turner had disclosed too much in the interview. Jimmy Kimmel questioned him during the interview on whether he was in love and whether he could even disclose that information to the public. Jerry admitted that he had fallen in love after he hesitated a little. With a joke, Kimmel stated he wasn't sure if he should have said that. There were many who had their suspicions, despite the fact that many supported Jerry and hoped he actually found happiness. Fans debated in an internet forum that they weren't positive Jerry was genuinely in love. Did anyone else think that Jerry seemed a little unsure about his response about being in love on Jimmy Kimmel the other night? Inquired one individual. He kinda looked off to the right when Jimmy said, you are, said an additional person. He does appear to be somewhat dishonest. The other half of fans believe that Jerry is only unsure about the franchise and is unsure of how to respond to the inquiry. I think he was just being cautious and not sure how much to reveal, a fan commented. In 2017, Jerry Turner's wife of 43 years passed away unexpectedly due to sickness. He applied for the show after attempting some online dating and getting encouragement from his daughters. He is the ideal candidate to be the first ever Golden Bachelor in the series. Jerry feels that it's never too late to fall in love and that he was ready to put himself out there once more. He hopes his partner is one of the attractive women in his season. As he gets to know everyone on the dates, Jerry has been having fun. There will, nevertheless, also be some heartfelt and touching moments. He'll discover that he starts to feel something for multiple people. Who he will ultimately choose is yet unknown. Have you been tuning into ABC every Thursday night to see The Golden Bachelor? Who would you recommend as Jerry Turner's partner? Watch to see if Jerry may finally meet the one and experience true love. Observe this space for updates.
Gabby Wendy shares her opinions on The Golden Bachelor, as well as her BIP adventure, with fellow bachelor at Rachel Recchia. The unexpected romance of Gabby Wendy following Bachelorette. Rejected candidates Gabby Wendy and Rachel Recchia were announced as the franchise's first ever co leads for season 19 of The Bachelorette, following their appearance on Clayton Eckert's season of The Bachelor. The engagement between Tino Franco and Rachel Recchia ended almost before it started. On the After the Final Rose special, they made the breakup announcement. A bit longer in their engagement, Gabby Wendy and Eric Schwer called it quits two months after the filming wrapped. On season 31 of Dancing with the Stars, she continued to dance through her heartbreak. Following the conclusion of DWTS in November 2022, Wendy largely avoided the public eye. Fans were taken aback when she revealed on ABC's The View in August 2023 that she was bisexual and in a relationship with a woman, in part because of this. Recently, the former bachelorette made it clear how committed she is to stand-up comedian Robbie Hoffman. How does she feel about the golden bachelor? Recently, Gabby Wendy discussed everything Bachelor Nation, including her new holiday clothing collection with Cupshi, in an interview with Life and Style. Regarding her debut into the fashion industry, she remarked, It's such a fun collection, and I hope everyone just really sees the joy that was put into it. Wendy is still a devoted follower, even though fans shouldn't anticipate seeing her compete on the ABC dating show series anytime soon. She gave the media her opinions on The Golden Bachelor. Wendy enthused over the franchise, calling it inspiring, and could hardly contain her delight. It actually made her eager to get older. Regarding her golden years, she remarked, Now I literally can't wait until 70. Her praise for the women fighting for Jerry Turner's heart is tempered by her concern for the 72-year-old retiree. It seems like these women might just run all over him, because I think he is quite shy. Though she is unsure of how the season will pan out, she believes Faith Martin is in the running to receive Turner's last rose. Gabby Wendy talks openly about Rachel Recchia's experience with VIP. Gabby Wendy isn't afraid to voice her thoughts regarding other former Bachelor Nation contestants. She recently attacked Clayton Eckerd for being the target of a paternity suit. So during her video conversation with Life and Style, she didn't hold back. On season 9 of Bachelor in Paradise, Wendy discussed her observations regarding Rachel Recchia's experience. At first, fans were worried that Gabby Wendy and Rachel Recchia's friendship from The Bachelor would be ruined by Bachelorette. Nonetheless, the two remained steadfastly supportive of each other during the filming. Wendy expressed her pride in her former co-star. She added that because the pilot is acquainted with the process, Recchia might have an advantage over the other competitors. Gabby Wendy is excited to watch Blake Moynes Katie Thurston's ex-fans, on VIP in addition to Rachel Recchia. Thursdays at 8 p.m. Eastern on ABC, The Golden Bachelor and Bachelor in Paradise Air. Thanks for watching if you like this video, so please don't forget to subscribe my channel and don't miss any updates.